Alright guys, today I've got another video here on my HTC One M8. Now, this isn't really going to be specifically for this device, even though it is. It's going to be more of a generic, because what we're going to talk about today is we're going to talk about Flashify, which is a very, very cool application. Just learned about it recently. I'm really loving it. I'm going to show it to you today. Basically, what this is going to need for this to function correctly is you're going to need to have an unlocked device with root access. Those are going to be your prerequisites. So this is unlocked with SOF and all that goodies. Um, if you want to see any videos on this device, check out my playlist on YouTube. They are loaded down with some awesomeness. So that being said, we're going to go ahead and open up. Basically, you got to give this thing root access, which you can see down the bottom. You saw the toast right there with the root access telling me it got root access. And then it, it's a very simple interface. I really, really like it. Basically, you have flash boot image, flash recovery image, flash zip file, and then over here it has backup and restore. And what I would do before you flash anything to your device, if you have Greenify, you have an unlocked, um, I'm sorry, if you have Flashify and you have um, unlocked bootloader and root access, you probably want to back up these two things. You can back up your current kernel and you can back up your current recovery, which would be stock recovery and stock kernel. Have those two backed up and they'll list right down here. So right now this is actually Torp Recovery I have installed. So I would go in here, back up to SD card, back it up, and shabam, you can see it added a backup down there. So if you do this before you flash anything to your device to, recover, to boot kernel or to recovery, you can have those two backed up and always get back to stock very easily with this. So very, very nice. Definitely like that a lot. Um, other thing I would show you before I get into some more of it, is you do have all your reboot stuff right here, which is just really simple. Reboot, reboot, recover, reboot, bootloader. Some settings, it's pretty nice. Um, settings, there's really not much in there, except for you can log in and send your backups directly to Dropbox or Google Drive, anything like that, and some other information on here as well. So very, very cool, definitely really liking this application. And then this is what I wanna show you. So normally to flash a boot image, or any image really, boot image, recovery image, you have to hook your computer, your device to your computer with the USB cable. You got to have the drivers. You've got to open a command window, type in a command, and flash things over. Well, with Flashify, no, you don't. It's very simple. Download the images to your device and flash them. So you could see that I'm running right now Torp Recovery, and it does check that every time the device or every time you open Flashify, it checks your recovery and your current kernel or boot image. So basically, if you want to do this, when I, what I'll show you is you can go into re Flash Recovery and you can download them and if it has them on its server, it'll just download the newest Torp or Clockwork or Phil's Touch Recovery and flash them, very easy. Or if you have them on your device, you can say choose file and I'm going to use, I'm going to use, well, you know, I'm not going to use that. We're going to cancel that. I'm going to use uh, their file explorer. And then we're just going to go scrolling down here to, not sure remember where I have this. I don't think it's in ROMs. Nope, it's not. It's going to be in the other folder. So we're going to go to SD card and then probably downloads. Oh, no, I remember where I put it. Right here. One images. All right, so here you go. So this actually has my insecure boot image, which I did a video on. Torp recovery image I did a video on. Um... Clockwork Mod Recovery Image I did a video on. Standard Recovery Original and Original Boot. So I have all these files in here and I can flash them back and forth however I want. So I have Twerp installed right now. I'm going to go ahead and do a very quick flash of Clockwork Mod Recovery. Now this is not the one I did the video on because this is updated and has better um, text size. And you'll see that in the video. So it just says, do you want to flash this? Yes. So you say, yep. And it's going to flash it. And then it says, reboot now? Sure. So now you're going to reboot, and you will see it's going to be Clockwork Mod Recovery. See, it's booting into recovery, and you will have this Clockwork Mod Recovery. Shabam. Bigger text. You can actually halfway read this thing. Um, actually, it looks normal to me, actually. It's a good size text. And boom, you just flash recovery. That simple. So Flashify is an absolutely awesome application. Um, I absolutely love it. 
very very cool so then I'll show you again just to get back to twerp just to show you how simple this is if you want to switch between recoveries if you want to flash kernels or boot images that they're just basically the same thing um, you can do it this way and it's just super nice super 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 nice um, so if you want to go back to your stock boot image or the insecure boot image you can just bounce back and forth all day long with flashify all right we're booted back up here let's just bounce back into flashify one last time um, just to do this because it's going to be pretty cool and we'll go ahead and again you can see it looks at your recoveries and now look now see it says it's clockwork mod recovery now so it checks that every time and let's go ahead and flash another recovery image really quick uh, limit reached this is interesting so this is a paid application this apply this app has a daily limit of three flashes you can unlock the limit with an in-app payment so you can buy the premium um, if you want and because of how awesome this is I would recommend that um, or you can wait till tomorrow and flash another one tomorrow because you can only do three a day I've obviously been playing with this thing already today and I really love it so I'll leave clockwork my recovery on there for right now but uh, still very cool you can even flash zips in it if you go right here and flash a zip you can do that too um, but like I said everything is limited to three flashes in one day unless you buy the premium version um, but definitely awesome awesome application highly recommend getting this if you have an unlocked device with root access this thing is awesome uh, that's what I wanted to show you guys on this device today again like I say HTC One M8 but this should work on any unlocked bootloader with root, re with root access on the device um, that's going to be all for me today Please stay tuned for more on this device and many, many others. You can check them all out at RootJunkie.com. We'll catch you guys in the next one. Root Junkie, out. Got a quick little PS here on uh, this video. This is my HTC One M8. Um, in case any of you guys are curious in what I actually have on this device, Right now I have a tempered armored screen protector on here, which is uh, pretty much my favorite uh, screen protector. It's like a piece of glass on top, so you don't feel like you have a screen protector on there, but you do. Super thin, very well, very good construction on it, um, and I absolutely love it. Way better than any of those film things that get all scuffed up after a while. This thing's solid. I have it in my pocket with my keys and everything, and it doesn't even hurt it at all very very nice also I have a cruiser light case on this sucker little circuit case Android and all that um, clear except for the backs kinda smoked so clear edges and smoked back um, definitely like it. the cruiser light makes my favorite cases also I always get them from there so if you guys want either of these things for your device um, you know I'll put a link to the tempered armor website in the video description along with cruiser light for the cases definitely go check them out once I get both those on any of my devices, like my Note 3 and any of the other ones I have, um, I'm pretty happy with uh, protecting them very, very well. So that's how I do it for me. That's how I roll. Thanks, guys.